what's up welcome back to my channel it's Dez with reviews by Dez welcome back so guys today I got my makeup collection right here um, you guys wanted to see my makeup collection and I got it right here I'm gonna start with the trays of stuff that I have and yeah and then we'll move on to the palettes and stuff makeup products are kind of two years old but this is a first makeup product it's the Fenty Beauty this is the unbutton lippy it's like a nude that I looks um put my bright put my ring light a little bit up okay and I'm gonna try this collection here. I'm gonna go by one by one. That's gonna take me forever. That's how they look right here. Oh my god, they're about to fall. That's all of them right there. Okay. I'm just gonna show them like this. So there's that one, this one, and this one. This clear one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. So these lippies, I got them on Amazon. I wanted a lip, lip, um, product like a pack of lip, lip sticks or whatever and I saw that a brand and I wanted to give it a try okay this light is like annoying me right now okay my camera's crooked but whatever okay so yeah I wanted to give those a try and I have this milk makeup lippy right here it doesn't does it say what shade it is uh slayer and don't ask me where I got this stuff because I honestly don't remember. You'll be asking the wrong person. And then I have another lippy from Fenty Beauty. This one. And this one is called Unattached. So I have these two. And then I have this Laura. What is this? Laura Mercier independent um, matte lipstick that's how this looks this is pretty old I'm surprised I still have this that's how that looks right there all right so we knocked the lippies out of here um, these are all my eyeliners as you can see these are liquid eyeliners and I kind of did a short on them, but I removed it, I think, because I felt like it was a brand already new. And these are my um, waterline eyeliners. And these are from the brand, from, it's from Instagram. It's the brand right there, Vivas. And these are from this brand right here also have this Lottie London Brow Artist Pencil. I think I got this once in my Walmart um, box. And then I also have this Billion Dollar Brows Universal Brow Pencil. And I don't remember where I got that from. And there are some random eyelashes in here. <laughs> that one's done is like all my pads that i have to remove my makeup i love these pads 
but I have yet to use the ones that I received from um, my Anchor Beauty Box, so I may love those more. Uh, all right, this is the fun part. So this is like all my primers, foundations, um, and concealers all in this basket. So we have, everything is dirty, I have to clean this stuff. We have this, which is the Hello Fab Coconut Skin Smoothie Priming Moisturizing. Moisturizer. Love it. This is my baby. I love this. Um, this is new, actually. I bought this the other day, but my go-to when it comes to primer. The other primer I have here is this CoverGirl True Blend Based business skin primer i haven't tried this one or maybe i have but my go-to is this one then the other primer i have is this glass primer rolio primer for flawless glow this one i don't think i've tried that one and guys anything i'm reviewing here if you want me to like well, anything I'm showing you guys here, if you want me to review anything, let me know in the comments and I'll do a review for you because you guys love my review videos. Okay, so the foundation, I have this baby right here, which is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Luminous Foundation. And I got this, I think, don't quote me on it, but I think I got this before and I don't remember, either Fat Fit Fun or something. And no, it wasn't Ipsy because I haven't got Ipsy in a while. Then this, I know I got. This is the Pixie by Petra Beauty Balm High Coverage Foundation. Really good foundation. Really good. Recommend it. And another primer I have here is this. Well, I don't know if this is a primer, but it's a serum glow filter. This. And from the Skin Ink Supplement Bar. Oh, brighten skin. Oh no, this is actually, no, look, it says one to two pumps before makeup as primer to brighten skin or even skin tone, oh, and even skin tone to help reduce the appearance of lines. Yeah, it is a filter, it is a primer. Figure, because it wouldn't be in my primer basket. And then this, I actually bought the other day because I realized I didn't have concealer. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Vitamin E Makeup Stick, and it's a concealer. And that is everything in this basket. I got these lashes, flat lash, eyelashes. Don't remember where I got these from. Just don't ask me. I really don't. Then, this is like a random one. I have this Dewy Blush Glossy Cheek Tint from Ciate London. I've never used this before. I think I used it once and I was like, oh, I don't like it. Um, this I bought because I thought I didn't have foundation. This is the NYX Total Control Pro Drop Foundation. Did not like this. Did not like it at all. Actually, surprise is still in here. I'm gonna take this out so I can brush it out. Um, then I have We Are Fluid nail polish. This is from Ipsy. I got this nail polish from my mother in law. I have this Kiss Power Flex brush on nail glue. And this was from when I was doing nail, like my own nails. I was making my own nails, I was making my own press on nails. Then I have, this is my favorite eyelash glue, Duo. I hope everything is focusing, guys, because I'm not really seeing it. All right, that's that. Then my beauty sponge is the Real Techniques, my go-to every time. I love how when they get like water inside, they get so fat. This one is dirty, but I have new ones. All right. And we're going into this little basket here. So this is another random skin products. 
This is the Studio Makeup Makeup Tint and Moisturizer. Rarely use this. Kind of like it, kind of don't like it. Really use this only in the summer. And I've used it a couple of times. It still has a like a lot in there. This, I don't know where I got this from. I can't remember if things are from AFC or um, from FabFitFun. Then I have this. This is a Revlon Photo Ready Prep Set Refresh Mist Spray, whatever. Barely use that. Then I have this Honest Extra Stream Mascara and Lash Primer. This is like a double sided. Let me show you. Here we have the primer on this side. And on this side, we have the foundation. Oh, foundation, mascara. Then I have this NARS. Tinted smudge proof eyeshadow base. I use this whenever I do my eyes so it pop. Oh, another primer. And then we have this the Pore Professional Pore Primer. I haven't used this yet, so as you guys can see, it looks brand new. I'm gonna put this with my primers. And a random Revlon Photo Ready Color Correcting Pen. What's that? It looks like it's double sided though. On this side we have the color correcting. Is there? Oh no, it's to click it up. <laughs> I knew that. Um, and that is that. Now we have this is all my palettes. This basket. There's also some makeup in here, so I'm just gonna show you. You guys seen this on my channel. This is the e.l.f. Lip Exfoliator in Brown Sugar. Um, I had a video on this, but I removed it because I don't like being harsh sometimes. So I just removed it, but I did leave the short for this. Okay, then we have this, my go-to. My go-to when it comes to mascara. The Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Like, if you don't have this, honey, go get it. Go get it right now. Go. Like that. And we have another nail polish. Another clear one. I don't know why I have two. I'm about to put it here with the other one. That's my mother-in-law. When she doesn't like the nail polish, she just gives it to me. Okay. Now we're going into, like, face palettes. Well, the little ones. We got this Fenty Beauty, and it's a highlight, as you can see right there. Very nice, very nice. And this is the Hustle Baby. Yeah. And then we have this NARS. So as you guys can see, I got some, you know, main brand, you know, I've upgraded a little bit since when I first started doing makeup, but. I just not, I don't have the energy. I don't have the energy to do makeup, like to do my makeup. Only for holidays and special occasion. So this is the NARS Laguna Sunkiss Bronzing Cream. And this is what it looks like. I barely touched it as you guys can see. I think I haven't touched it because I was like scared to use it because I don't really know how to use like cream bronzer. Then I have this NARS this is a deep throat. Um, this is supposed to be a blush. Name is Deep Throat. That's what it's called. I've never seen that name until now. Now I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> My innocent ears. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, and then we have this Fenty Beauty Pro Filter. This is a soft matte powder foundation. I'm gonna sit back there. I haven't seen that. It's this, I think I got this in Fabric Fun. I was excited about this, so I know it's Fabric Fun. I don't have this Koki Professional Translucent Setting Powder. That's how it looks back there. See, I got some makeup, guys. I got some makeup. I just, I'm lazy. All right, now we're going into the palettes. I'm going to start with the small ones. 
So I have this one from Glam Light. And this is the Chocolate Marshmallow and Graham Cracker palette. How it looks. I love using this palette. It's my go-to. It's one of my go-tos. Then we have this NARS palette. And that's how that looks. Shades are beautiful. But I barely touch it because I don't do my makeup like that. And we have this palette. You guys seen this on my channel before because I reviewed it with another palette that I don't have anymore. That's how it looks right there. I hope I'm not going too fast, guys. I'm so sorry if I'm going fast. But you guys know I got two kids and I can't be I can't be taking my time no more. So we have this palette, the Ace Beauty Glow Essentials Highlight Palette. That's how that looks. My other go-to. And we have this Ofra. Now let me tell you guys. Ofra I didn't know about until I met my friend Innocent Sosero, which her name is actually Ariel. Well, I hope that's her name. <laughs> no, it's not Ariel. <sighs> it's Sandy, okay? When I met my friend Sandy, who her YouTube name used to be called Innocent Sosero, she introduced me to Ofra, and oh my god. But this is not the highlighter palette. This is the brown um, blushes, which I didn't know they had blush. I didn't know. And I am Anna. We have that one. Then we have this beauty right here. This is the Lizzie McGuire, What Dreams Are Made Of palette. I did a review on this palette. It's how beautiful that palette is. We have this Violet Voss Essentials 2 palette. These are definitely from Ipsy, as you guys can tell. I like the packaging and stuff. Then we have this Stoned Vibes palette from Urban Decay. I got this palette only because of the packaging. So pretty, I barely touch it. Oh, that's why I don't touch it. Oh, we are almost done. Oh no, guys, look, I have the other palette here. Oh, I didn't know that. So now we have the Spectrum palette here. I don't know why, because I barely play with colors. <laughs> if you guys been with me, you've seen this palette before. She is a beauty, and all my palettes just fell. Hopefully, they're gonna get destroyed. This palette is amazing, guys. Like, if you haven't got this palette, oh my god, you're missing out. Like, the mirror comes out. It comes up now she has other makeup <laughs> and this shit is old i didn't know okay might as well grab this palette this is the first one right there so this palette i actually did a short on it i haven't reviewed it yet but if you guys want me to swatch it let me know again in the comments but that's how it looks right there all of its beauty my boyfriend actually got me this palette. Um, I think it was for our anniversary. He got me this palette for Christmas. One, but he got me this palette, and I love it so much because I've never ever had a Morphe palette. The only Morphe palette I ever had was Jaclyn Hill palette, which everybody and their mama had that palette. But I never had a number palette with the Morphe on the side. Okay, then I have this palette, and this is the Avani Greg times Morphe for the Bebs palette. I only got this palette because of this, like the color, like it's so beautiful. But don't use it because of that, you know? Like that's supposed to be eyeliner, and no. So this palette, I don't know what to do with it. I don't know, maybe, maybe give it to my niece or something, I don't know. Uh, then we have this Snooky Shadows palette from the Snooky Shop. I only got this palette because if you're a Jersey Shore fan like me, you understand. But this palette is actually really beautiful. That's how that looks. And we got two more palettes and we're done. <laughs> Alright, then we have this Amrezy palette. Anastasia Beverly Hills and 
she is used honey now like i said this makeup is probably like two to three years but it hasn't been giving me no lashes so i think i'm fine <laughs> And the last palette in here is this one, the Wander Beauty Wondrous Escape. Gorgeous. All right, guys. So, before I put everything away, that is my makeup collection. Believe it or not, that's all I have from all the makeup that I had before. This is like my cut down, basically. Um, the only reason I decluttered and I don't have as much makeup is because I don't touch it. So it's like, I'm not gonna buy something if I'm not gonna really touch it. I'm gonna have something for just in case I need it, but I become a minim minimalist basically, and I only keep things that I need. I'm still keeping a lot of clutter and stuff, but I'm not as bad as I used to be. And that's showing me that I'm making progress and that's God helping me, you know, with my wisdom and everything. So that is everything for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I hope you guys enjoyed looking at my makeup collection. Hope you guys learned something new in this video. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day night wherever you are. Before you go, don't forget to like this video. Um, hit that subscribe button, you know, so you can join my squad. And comment below, comment below anything. Do you want me to review something that you saw? Um, do you want me to swatch a palette? Like, comment, because that's the only way we can talk to each other, unless you guys DM me on Instagram, which is right here. Hope you guys have a wonderful day, night, wherever you are. God bless you, Jesus loves you, and thank you for watching. Bye.